A police officer from Bethel Park is recovering tonight after he was hurt in a hit and run. The police chief tells KDKA the driver was under the influence and kept going until another officer stopped him. Jessica Guay is at the police department with concerning information about the driver that was just discovered. Yes, Bethel Park police say the man was driving on a suspended license for a previous DUI, but they say what's even more shocking, he has more than a dozen prior DUI convictions. A traffic stop for a red light violation on South Park Road turned dangerous Tuesday night. Bethel Park Police Chief Timothy O'Connor says an impaired driver flew by without headlights on and hit one of his officers who was providing backup. You believe the mirror first impacted his, his arm and, and torso, knocking him into a stopped police vehicle, and then his foot was ran over. He says the driver, 67-year-old Richard Caporal, kept going, but another officer ran after him and flagged him down. The criminal complaint details how the officer could smell alcohol on him and his speech was slurred. However, he told police he had just one beer. Chief O'Connor says Caporal has 14 prior DUI convictions. So he is under uh, suspension for, for being DUI, so he should not be driving. He also didn't have his headlights on the at the same time. It is very frustrating when uh, people are uh, convicted and then they continue to drive. The injured officer was released from the hospital and is now recovering at home. His fellow officers are thankful he wasn't seriously hurt. We're very fortunate because if he had hit the officer flush, like with the front end, that we may not be having this talk right now. The chief says this is a reminder of how dangerous the job can be. And ironically, his department honored fallen officers on Wednesday. Welcome to the annual Bethel Park Police Department Memorial Day service. As the honor roll riders biked for miles to the department's Stowe Memorial. One call away from being harmed or, or, or worse, uh, we have Police Memorial Day coming up in, in shortly. And uh, we, we always take a, a week out of the month of May to acknowledge the sacrifices of those that, that go out and they never know the dangers they're going to face. Caporal is in the Allegheny County Jail facing a long list of charges including aggravated assault and DUI. In Bethel Park, Jessica Gway, KDKA News.